Hey there, good morning, beautiful people. I'm coming to you extra early today with a keto kitchen because I'm using my slow cooker and I'm going to need lots of time to get things going. And give me just a second and get myself shared out in a couple of my favorite groups and get going. So what I'm making today by popular vote is the St. Louis style keto barbecue ribs. So it's super simple to make y'all. And it's three pounds of ribs, one large onion, a half a cup of water, and some sugar-free barbecue sauce. I like to use this uh, G Hughes, D H G, nope, G Hughes, G, G Hughes <laughs> sugar-free barbecue sauce. That's my sauce of preference. So let's get started. Um, first thing you're going to do is you're going to take a large onion and you're going to slice it. So try not to cut yourself while you're doing it, you know. <laughs> I always make my husband very nervous when I'm slicing vegetables. I really don't know why. I've been doing it for years. <laughs> and I'd like to say I've never cut myself. I'm sure that would be a fib, though. <laughs> okay, so we've got the onions all sliced up, and then we're going to put them into the slow cooker, which I'll show you in a second because my ribs are in the way. I can't pull it up. But we're just going to throw the onions down into the bottom of the slow cooker and there we go one one more there we go so there you go got onions all over the bottom and then we're going to add a half a cup of water then we get this onion one out of the way have three pounds of ribs right here. Now my slow cooker is a little, it's oblong, but it was still a little too short for my ribs, so I cut them in half. I've got two pieces. I'm gonna set those on top of the onions, side by side there, and we'll get rid of the meat tray. And pull this up a little bit so you can see it angle it down just a little bit. There you go. Now you can see I've got the meat on top of the onions with a cup of water. We need a cup of the barbecue sauce. It takes two cups total, but you're only going to put one cup in the slow cooker. So let's measure that out. And you're going to cook these on low for eight hours. So we're going to pour this over the top of the ribs and I like to get them good and coated, so I grab one of these uh, barbecue brushes. And we'll just get all that goodness out of that cup. And I just take it and I brush it all over the ribs. So it's nice and coated. And we set that to low for eight hours. You can also do it on high for three to four hours. I don't recommend that. Low and slow is the way to go if you want a nice tender rib. They, it'll work, it'll be cooked, but they won't be quite as soft and tender and fall off the bone and juicy yummy. So go with the eight hours and that's why I'm starting so early today. There is one more step that I'm not gonna be able to show you because it's gonna happen eight hours from now. When these are done in here, we're going to pull them out, put them on a cookie sheet with aluminum foil, and we're going to add the other cup of barbecue sauce, throw them in the oven under a broiler for about three to four minutes until the sauce starts bubbling up really good. And then you pull them out and you're good to go. You've got St. Louis style, keto friendly barbecue ribs. So that's coming to you just in time for the holiday weekend. I hope you get a chance to try this recipe. It is amazing. And if you are new to watching me uh, do the Keto Kitchens and you wanna see more, just touch my nose, hit the three buttons at the top, and 
select follow where you can send me a friend request. I'm very friendly and I, I love making new friends, so feel free to friend me or follow me. If you want to be notified when I do go live, normally I'm here every Monday night, six o'clock central standard time doing a new keto kitchen, but sometimes I come on throughout the week. So if you want to catch me, uh, you can hit my nose again, hit the three dots again and get notific notifications from Facebook when I come live. So that's entirely up to you. Um, I have an amazing recipe group with lots of support for keto lifestyle. If you are interested in that group, please drop VIP down in the comments for me and I will reach out and get you into that group as well. I do get a lot of my recipes from there and I also share some of my recipes out there as well. So you're welcome to be part of that group if you'd like, just drop VIP. Um, I think that's about all I got for you this morning. It was a super quick, super fast, super easy recipe. I mean, you just set it and forget it, basically. I'll come back in about eight hours and pop this bad boy out, put a little barbecue sauce on top, broil it, and we're gonna have some barbecue ribs for dinner tonight. So, I love y'all. Have a blessed week. Uh, yes, uh, sorry, Janet, I just saw that. Ribs won, so um, I'll probably make the cauliflower uh, style potato salad soon too you know how i am i always end up doing both of them it's just this is the winner so y'all picked ribs i brought ribs um we're gonna get going though i've got a lot on my plate today i've got some things i need to be cooking for a barbecue we're having or a, a crawfish boil we're gonna have this weekend so i need to get some stuff together and get that all ready I gotta go store. Oh my goodness, I'm just gonna be busy, busy, busy. So anyway, I'm rambling on and on and I'm not used to being up this early, so y'all are getting me in my pajamas and the whole nine yards. But hey, I don't care. I promised you ribs, I've got ribs. Here we go, enjoy. I love you all, I'll see you soon. Bye. Thanks for your watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will have more power to publish the next videos if you subscribe this channel and enable all notifications to make sure you never miss any videos in the future. Thank you so much. I'll see you in the next videos.